Hello and welcome to a Moodle course where you can practice uh, your Moodle skills uh, completely free. This is onlinecoursesforfree.com. Today I'm going to show you everything about grades and the gradebook. So first thing I'm going to do is uh, go into grades on the blue strip. And notice this is where they are, grades. Okay, and that's the blue strip. I'm using Moodle 4.3.3 and move as the theme move is completely free by the way and i really really like it right so next let's go into grades click on it and here it comes notice it asks to give me a tour but i'll skip the tour for now and um, notice what i have here under grades going to uh, see everything so i can explore it by going into the grade reporter and everything else about it. Notice I'm going to close the left. The right is closed. So let me close the left here, the course index. Now it's closed. And open the grader report. Now notice what's available here. Grade history. If, in case you missed that, I'm on the left here. Okay, under the grade reporter. And I just opened the flap and I got all of these amazing features under grader report. All right, so let's take up all of them one at a time so we can explore. So after that, there's grade history and then outcomes report. And notice it opens up something else, single view. And then you can go by users. Notice what's available here, all participants. And then users, grade items. If you have grade items, I don't see any grade, any items here that are graded. Grade summary. Okay, so these are some great summary activities, I guess. User report, if that interests you. And then the grade book setup. Yay, here it is. The grade book setup. Now you have to realize that Moodle keeps changing. So that, uh, depending of course on the theme, but th since this is Moodle 4.3, there are a lot of changes. And the grade book is no longer where it used to be. It's under grades notice the blue strip so let's go into the grade book setup that's still the same all right so these you'll see all the uh, activities that are graded notice you get 610 which is fine okay you can also change this so that you get a hundred okay the first one is ten percent so you're going to get 610 but you can actually uh, change that if you wish but you don't have to because the grades will ultimately be out of 100. But you can edit the calculation by going into calculations and it takes you somewhere else where you can calculate and decide what you want to give for each of these items, grade items. All right, so let me not confuse you too much. Let's go back into the grades and the user report. Grade book setup, course grade settings. You can set that up the way you want it. That's another option. I'm just walking you through all the features. Preferences for the greater report. Scales, uh, if you want to have scales, outcomes, grade letters, import, export. All this information is available here for you to use. All right, so I hope this has been of help and you'll be able to continue the exploration. And let me know what you come up with. Thank you for watching. Enjoy Moodling. And the opportunities that learning to Moodle and teaching with Moodle offers teachers. Thank you.